Welcome or welcome back. At, uh, I need help at c squared. In this example, we have this function f of x equals 3 plus 4x squared, and we need to find and simplify the different quotient. And if you notice here, I said the different quotient is a measure of the average rate of change. Average rate of change of the function over an interval. So the average rate of change if you remember, is f of b minus f of a over b minus a. The slow formula, right, is an interval a to b. Okay, so how is this different quotient related? I'm going to call it dq. Different quotient is very similar. Is f of x plus h minus f of x over h or if you want to do x plus h minus x that will be what i'm calling h okay so you see now how these two are related so for finding these different quotient my first thing will be to evaluate f of x plus h for our formula and that will be 3 plus 4 times the quantity x plus h raised to the second power. Uh, and here I'm going to move a little bit faster that x plus h to the second power is x squared plus 2xh plus h squared. I use the special product with, uh, if you remember uh, that will be the fastest way. If you don't use FOIL now I'm going to use the distributive property and we have 4 times x squared for x squared plus 4 times 2xh, that will be 8xh plus 4 times h squared for h squared. And that's it for the f of x plus h. Now we're going to go back here and we're going to replace it with this expression and we have 3 plus. 4x squared plus 8xh plus 4h squared. So this is what we call f of x plus h minus f of x, which is 3 plus 4x squared. So it's going to be minus 4x squared here over h. Now, the first thing you should notice, and if it doesn't happen, that means you have a problem here is some cancelling. Yeah, these guys cancel out. So now we have left here 8x, 8xh plus 4h squared over h. We can factor out an h here. And we have 8x plus 4 H. And another thing that will cancel out, hopefully you already noticed, is this H. So we have the final form here. The different quotient of this expression is 8x plus 4H. Okay. This is a very good thing to learn, especially if you need to take more math classes like calculus, where you do the derivative using this difference quotient. If you enjoy this uh, example, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.